Hello everyone, my name is Odinson and this is Modded Minecraft, Die Wolf 20 1.19 pack episode 16 I believe, quote me on that. Alright, I have got my sword in my ha uh, sword? Saw in my hand because I've been chopping trees. Um, just going to do a quick catch up on what I've been up to. Okay, so you saw me, I moved all of this system into here that we had over there. Pretty similar sort of system. All you do is you do the pattern provider to the chest and then an import bus with just the finished products coming out of it. Put the capacity card in there so I could put three items in there. And then I've also automated the uh, charging of Certus Quartz. So again, pattern provider with the recipe in there, one charge Certus Quartz with one Certus Quartz, and then the exporter, <coughs> sorry, the importer importing to the system only Takes out charge sets quartz when it's done. So that's all done. So I'm all right with my auto crafting for now. I'm going to get into some actual crafting recipes soon. Why is this still open? Ah, I missed a spot. Um, no, that's right. What I want to do is just get three of them, maybe three. Uh, just two. Okay. And throw that down and go straight back in. Good. <clears throat> All right. Um, so yeah, not much else to report. We're still growing the old certs quartz this way. We're going to get into that in a bit. We're going to get into auto crafting actual recipes rather than processing recipes. Um, probably in the next couple of episodes. Uh, but today I wanted to make a start on another mod. And that mod is going to be... Batania or Batania or however you want to pronounce it. The first thing we're going to need is the Lexica Batania. It's that book there. It's just a book of Blessed Sapling. This gives us all the basics, blah, blah, blah. <coughs> but I know how to get started in this. So one thing we are going to want to make is an apothecary. A telepothecary. Uh, hmm. Oh, it just needs to be a petal. Okay. Let's see. If I just do this. Cool. And then we'll go back to a uh, path. We're just going to make a cobblestone one for now. That's good. Um, so I'm going to use this strip of land up here. And I'm probably going to expand it out further that way. As I've got like so many materials now. It really just doesn't matter anymore. Um, I kind of want to get rid of this tree though. Before I do anything else. Boop. Yeah. I'm going to fill all this in. Wow. Not all of it because that goes way down but um i'm definitely going to expand this out but anyway um what i want to do is put this apothecary down here and there's a little bit more craft that i want to do before i actually get started uh let's do this oh that's so good feels so good to be able to do that now all right uh what i want to do is at functional Hmm. What I want to do is get some of these 2x2 two two drawers. Okay, so that needs a bunch of chests. Um, it's not what I wanted, mate. Oh, please, just stop with the recipes, right. Well, one, two, three, four, probably five. Times four will be 20. Okay, so now we're never going to need chests again. <laughs> okay. 12, 16, 20. Thank you very much. All right, let's go back up there. Right, there are 16 different color flowers in B B 
Batania. Batania. I'm going to call it Batania because that's what I'm used to and I don't really care what you think. Okay. That's good. So this is where we're going to store our petals. Um, okay. Good stuff. We'll also make a compacting drawer with them. That's good to know. That's how you make that. Collector. Interesting. Okay. Anyway. Um, right. I've got the storage drawers and everything. So I want. Uh, no. What I'm going to search for in here is flower. All right. Mr. Clorange. And we've got some lime. Got some red. Got grey. Alright. And that's it for now. And then um Petal. I made some lime ones. Alright, and what I want to make is um floral fertilizer. And that's just any any dyes and bone meal. Fine. Okay. Um. Oh. Oh. All right. Gonna be like that. That's fine. We will just pulverize you instead. In the meantime, I'm going to turn these into petals. Uh -huh. Turn that into dye. All right, that's good. Um, and then what we can do is... Uh, da, 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 da. The wrong thing. There we go. Hello, Moth. If I do this, oh, we got six. Two, three, four, five, six. That's going to get us a start. Um, get one more. Uh-huh. Seven. Seven. Oh, need to sleep. We're doing stuff outside now, so. Another lovely day in Minecraft here. Okay. So let's do this thing. Um, we're going to go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Gonna break all these down. Okay, I'm gonna turn these into petals. Oh my god, what is going on? Right. You. You. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Okay, so we've got 12 of the colours so far. Oh no, there's one more. 13 of the colours so far. Now what you could do with these, which is pretty nifty. And I don't think you need shears anymore, which is good. But I do need to go and get my bone meal because I'm an idiot.
Right. So, for instance, I've got plenty of orange already, so let's do something like the grey ones here. Okay. So you can plant these petals in the ground like that. And then if you bone meal them, they grow into... So you use two petals, but they grow into these tall ones. And what that will give me is four. Eight. So from two, I got eight. I'm going to go one, two, three, four. Just going to do four. So it's a good way of getting a bunch of flowers really quickly. A bunch of petals really quickly. So I need to do these yellows for sure. And then we're going to put them. One, two, three, four. Convert them. Greens. Yep. And one thing we definitely need to do is the whites. That's all the bone meal we got for the moment. All right, but what we can do is stick them in these corners like this. Gray, yellow, green, brown, lime, purple, pink. Oops. Right. Dark grey, black, red, and orange. All right, that's good. Now, one thing I wanted to get because I know I'm going to need it is a couple of stacks of cobblestone. Gonna need some wood. Whip over there. Gonna take that stack of that. There. All right. So first things first. I know I need a water source out here. So um, well, I've kind of got one just here anyway. Uh, so we're gonna open our bag. Put that away. And I didn't put the cyan petals away. Gonna take these buckets. Okay. Perfect. Now the first thing we're gonna need to make is what is called a pure daisy. We've got 13 out of the 16 so far. So this needs to have water in it. Now, if we look at the uh, Lexica Britannia and everything, we need more fertilizer, blah, blah, blah. Can be made for the dye. Yep. Mystical petals. All right, pure daisy. Here we go. So living word, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we need four white petals. Okay, I'm gonna stick that in here. And what you do, um, that's what else I needed was seeds. So I'm gonna take a stack of those. Nice. And what you do, you just literally one, two, three four and then a seed boom it uses the water and i've got my first uh flower the pillager hello mate ready to die
All right. So one thing that the pure daisy does, which is really handy. I think this needs actual stone. Yeah. Well, that's annoying. Take all this and we're going to go down there. And we're going to um, do this, but we're going to rinse all the power in the system. Go, go, go. All right. So the A system could keep up with 16 times speed, but not 32. Three, two, one, done. All right. Oops. Stone. Um, whoop. The hell? They're literally everywhere, them things. All right. One, two, three. Four, five, and you can surround the pure daisy. It needs to be within a block, basically. You can see you get these particle effects. And what happens is, I'm gonna see in a second. Eventually, And you can automate this as well with annihilation paint and construction paints from um, Applied Energistics later. <clears throat> Come on. God. I forgot how long this takes. There we go. And now it's converting. And what this gives us is um, living rock. Which we are going to need. And the other thing you can do with it is place down logs. Same thing. I really should take this guy out. I hate doing this all the time. But... I just hate having the traders around even more, unfortunately. Close to night time, and that's not done, so I'm gonna take a nap. As soon as it lets me. And hopefully. Oh, but it should be close. There we go. And what we get is living wood. Perfect. Okay, so we know what the pure daisy does. I know we're gonna need another storage drawer here. But that'll do for now, because we still got three more types of flower to collect. All right, so next up. Uh, Batania runs is a magic magic slash tech mod that um, runs on a thing called. Did I really? Where did I put? Wow, I actually put them away into the system. 
Okay. So I'm going to need a crafting table out of here. Uh... So, one, two, three, four. Okay. Let's go. Up there for a minute. All right. So, at Batania, we are going to need a wand to begin with. Where are they? Nope. 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 Okay, have they changed? Do they look different? Not really. So it's three living wood. If I do this. And then sticks it. No. Okay. Ah. Well that would. Great. That is um not what is required. Okay. Not them. Okay. Recipes have changed a bit. So three of them and any two petals. So we'll take one of the most numerous ones we got. We just go one, two, three, four, oops, five. Right. And we got a wand of the forest. Just gonna stick that in there until we don't need to anymore. Okay, wander the forest. So next thing we need is a mana, a mana pool, which is just five of that living rock, like that. And this is how we collect mana, at least in the beginning. And we can place this a bit of a distance away because. And now we also need a mana spreader. We need a gold for that. And we need a bunch more living wood for that too. So let's get some. Right. Gold. And it was just any petal, so that's good. And we will take a yellow petal for this. Now we're just waiting on you. Whilst we're waiting on you, I know I need another. Um, Another one of these. Uh, I can put them sticks away and stack. All right. Go, that's grown. Perfect. All right, mana spreader. This, that, that. Oh my god. All right. Uh, you can go away. And then we can put that there. Oops. Put these here instead reasons all right so I want to put my mana spreader like here and what I want to do is with my wand of the forest I'm going to link them now you can only see these particles but what this mana spreader does is in Bat Batania you get the mana from um, generating flowers flowers that generate mana so what we want to get now, and we want to look at you know, da, 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 mystical flowers. No. OK. 
Okay, not that. What else are you asking me to do to unlock this? Black Lotus? Runicolta? Little Apothecary? Generating flora, here we go. All right. So the end of flame is where we're gonna start. Uh, we need gray, brown, and red. Hmm. I need more brown. It's a way to use this stuff. Uh, Phyto grow. We need sand. Telling me I got no gravel? Rarely. Not enough hot bar space. Uh, let's go to the pulverizer. Okay, and it's used all its power. When, yeah, I could set up this on auto crafted as well, so I can put all these recipes in, fire and forget. All right, go back up here. So if I do this, and I go with a uh, fight to grow. Yeah, I can make a bunch of that stuff. All right, now hopefully this will work on flowers. One, two. Yep, sure it does. Oops. I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we got 32. Okay. And I need to sleep. Okay. Go. Right, now where was I? One red and one light grey. Oh, dude. Go away.
Okay, we've got water, we need a seed. Gives us our first endo flame, and we're going to place this like near the um, mana spreader. And then what we can do is it burns normal combustibles like a furnace would almost. And what I'm going to do is give it, because I got all that coal coke. And I don't really need to use it for making steel. If I throw that there, it should eat it. If I get my wand, you can see that the mana spreader is... And it's sending it into there, and we're collecting mana. So that's it. So now we're generating mana... From Batania for the first time, the particle effects are cool. And um, we're going to get a few more of these endo flames in the next episode of stuff. We're going to take our next steps from there. So that's been it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, until next time, stay safe.